understand inflation? <laughs> See, inflation has been averaging 3 to 5% since way ahead of our time, like since the Great Depression like in 1929. Yes, ma'am. Since the Great Depression, it's been averaging 3.5. Sometimes it's higher, sometimes it's lower, but averaging 3.3 to 5%. Now, let's say if you went out here and they gave you a 2% pay raise, but Anisha, get what they're going to say. Don't you tell nobody. Shh. But everybody don't get no raise. And we, right. we like you. I mean, you really show up to work on time, you come early, you stay late, so we're giving you a 2%. But don't they fire people for talking about how much you got? They do, they do, yeah. Now, so you ain't going to tell nobody. And you think that, Lord, Lord, I'm all right now. They done done me good. But did you get a pay raise? Because in cost of living, inflation was 3%. And you got a 2%. You are minus one. And we're running down the road. This is happy. It's easy to rob you when you don't know you're being robbed. Okay. You're not going to see none in your check. Oh, no. And guess what? Let's say if cost of living doubled in 20 years. Okay, okay so you start out with 100000 20 years later, you make it 200000 You still got the same equivalent purchasing power that you started out with 20 years ago. Sure. Why? Cost of living doubled. <coughs> but let's go talk about what you were talking about, though. Mm -hmm. What happened to my money? I made it. Yeah, you make it and the government take it. It's called taxes. Yes, sir. The more you make, the more they take. <laughs> right? Yeah. Now, here's another thing I want you to understand about taxes. You're going to lose about one third of it. Mm -hmm. Before you see it, they get gone. Now, the government kind of smart. They say, well, look here. Now, these folks, and they Christian folks, a lot of them, and uh, man, they don't even, God say, just give me a dime on every dollar I give you. 10%. Mm -hmm. And they say, well, they ain't giving God, so I better take mine. And that's what they do, don't they? Mm -hmm. So they're going to take a, th let me look at this here. Let's say if you make $6,000, married, children, house, car, and pets, and dogs, and what have you. Now, if you make $6,000, you lose $2,000, one third, on taxes, right? Mm -hmm. yeah. They'll leave you $4,000 mm -hmm. to make, take care of all your living expenses and everything, don't you? Mm -hmm. Now, out of your living expenses, let's say you got your nice little house and you got your nice family and you got your car and your kids and everybody doing pretty good and you keeping up with the Joneses. What's your last name? Oh, Why are you keeping up with the Joneses now? <laughs> yeah, I, I had an interview with Mr. Mrs. Jones. And I said, man, why am I trying to keep up with y'all? You know what they told me? I said, child, I don't know. We tired. Why are you trying to keep up with us? We, so we tired trying to keep up with ourselves. <laughs> but here's the thing. Let's say... House, car, well, husband and wife working, 